Welcome, hey, and welcome. This is Invisible with you again. Playing Persona 3 Face. And have you ever noticed the collection of videos? <coughs> the day is still 24, 21 for Tuesday in the evening. In this video, I will show you <coughs> the maybe the only thing if it, the, it wasn't the well, one of the things that Jennifer says. That I do believe it may be the only thing if there was nothing else that's really making any sense at all. I do believe the uh, developers placed this, placed this on purpose. So, hey, you know that thing we use to summon our personas? The evoker. <coughs> well, I was thinking, why does it have to look like a gun? I mean, you gotta be a little nutty to point a gun at your head and pull the trigger, you know. I do believe it's somehow a way <coughs> to call the personas in a, 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 well, listen here, okay? I do believe that it's like this. To be able to call a persona, you'll need to make some kind of sacrifice in order to, you know, call them. So, y to do so, uh, sorry for saying too many so's. <coughs> In order to call the persons, you will need to get, make some kind of sacrifice. And the best way to make these sacrifices are by using the invoker into your head to unbolt the trigger. As you know, one hit, one shoot to the head means an instant death. In this case, it means uh, an instant sacrifice to call your personas. And in my own <coughs> uh, situation, it's a way that I used to call Orpheus to me. So then, that uh, been explained, thanks all for watching this new section, and if I ha noticed anything else, I will inform you. So then, invisible with you, logging out. See you all later, and please check out for my adversaries trailer, and it's teaser as well. Good luck everyone, see ya.